No, 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 no. What did you do? Mira lo que le hiciste a los pisos. Te dije que no andes trayendo a tus amigos tan cochinos y marranos que hacen puro cochinero aquí. Ma, no es mi amigo, es un serial killer. A mí no me importa si come cereales, Freddy Cuco o su abuela en bikini. Please save me. Man, you know how it feels. Run, run. Here's the lot of them, Captain. Each one willing to die for your every command. You, sailor! Hello. What's his name? Uh... I don't even think this one here's a pirate, sir. You're not a pirate. I, I'm a... I, I, I'm, I'm a pirate. Are you a pirate? I, I'm a pirate. You don't even look like a pirate. What do you mean? I've got the pirate outfit, the hat, the rips. Oh, yeah, whatever. Okay, do something that a pirate does. Arr! He sounds like a dog. He does sound like a dog. You sound like a dog. Do that again. Uh, Arr! Yep, just like a dog. You know what? Change this guy's name to Mr. Puro. He sounds like a Puro. You, sailor. What is your name? My name is Juan. Juan? Yes, Juan. Okay. Mr. Horn, are you prepared to follow orders and stay true in the face of almost certain death? Horn, answer man! I think so. Just say that again, but super slow. I don't think he heard you. I'm beginning to think you're not a pirate, Lev. I am a pirate. What makes you a pirate, Lev? Check out my eye patch. Huh. What happened? Oh, uh, uh, no, 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 no. It's just a cool eye patch. I, I bought it. It's pretty nice. Why don't you have an eye patch? Yeah, why don't you have an eye patch? I don't, I don't need an eye patch. What did he say? Say that again, but a little slower because this guy didn't understand. Now that's a party. Okay, hold on. This guy is not a pirate. Yes, I am a pirate, Mr. Poodle. Check this out. Hmm. What was that? Jalapeno juice. Ah! 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 Told you he wasn't a pirate. Looks like I'm looking for a new first mate. Did you think he wouldn't find you? Please, let me go. I'll do anything. You had your chance. This won't be easy for you. I didn't plan on it being easy. Hey! My name is Obi-Wan Kenobi. And I'm here to mock the floors. It's a big spear. It's a real doozy, this one. If I were you, I'd get out of here while you still have the chance. Oh, no, senor. I can't just quit like that. I would at least have to give my two-week notice. What? Plus, where else am I going to get work right now? Are you hiring? No. And if you don't want to get hurt, 
I'd walk away. Sometimes walking away hurts more than staying. It is in the midst of pain that we grow the most. What are you ranting about? I mean, I think I'm gonna stick it out here, you know? It's a little risky and the pay isn't very good, but the boss told me in two to three years, I might be assisting manager, and I'll get my own parking space up front, I get to make my own schedule. That's pretty cool, huh? I hope I stay humble, though. Do you know what I mean? Listen, Obi-Wan, that is your name, right? Well, my name is Obi-Wan Nacho de la Cruz Rodriguez Martinez Lopez. Kenobi. Okay. What I'm saying is, after I'm finished with him, I'm gonna take care of you. Okay, I appreciate that. But just because I work here doesn't mean I can't take care of myself. But you're welcome to leave me a generous tip right over there on that table. I won't even look. Go for it. That's it. That guy didn't even leave a tip. But I forgot to give him his food. You know, no big deal. I'll go take care of that, okay? Now you will know the true power of the dark side. That was quite the spill. How are you doing that? Well, I don't want to brag, but I've been mopping for years. The force is strong with this one. Oh my goodness, you got all the way over here? That's crazy. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'll clean this up right away. Don't worry about it. I got it. Okay, look at that. Oh man, hope the boss doesn't see this. Okay, all done. This isn't over. Oh, you're right. I forgot a spot right there. Oh, clean, senor. That was amazing. Oh, come on. It's my job. May the floor be with you. Thank you. Here, take this. Goodbye, Obi-Wan. I quit! What is that? Thought I put away all them tools. Well, oh, rats and pants, that's heavy. That is some serious geoengineering. That is my hammer. Yeah, I was gonna pick that up, but I thought I better just wait to see whose it was. You couldn't pick it up if you tried. You saw me? Only those who are worthy can pick up the hammer. Hey, senor. Would you like me to put this away with the rest of the tools? Well, mass and tats. How'd you do that? It just doesn't seem sturdy enough, though. It feels kind of cheap, to be honest. How is that possible? Hey, who's the new guy? Can you walk a lawnmower? Well, I don't know. I think he flew in on a chemtrail or something, looking for his hammer. I am Thor, son of Odin. Oh, I'm Juan, son of Juan. Son of Juan? Oh, well, my dad's name is Juan. Not that I came from one parent. I know that can be really confusing. So technically, I am Juan, son of Juan, son of two. Son of a gun. How'd you pick up the hammer? Uh, with my hand. You lie. Okay, you know what? You're right, okay? I picked it up a little bit using my back. It was bad form, okay? My bad. Are you mocking me? Calmate, compa. You know we have to mess with the new guy. It's initiation. Oh, he's not new. I don't even know him. I think he's with the government, though. 5G in the flesh. And you know this mortal? Yep. He's my boss. Your boss? Yep. Juan's hot gardener service. Took me right out of business. But I say, if you can't beat them, you join them. Great benefits, too. It's true. You would love to work here. Just give me back my hammer. You want me to throw this at you? Is that mental? I don't know what that means, but yes, throw it at me. It is super dangerous and not appropriate on the job. But since this is my company, it's okay. Oh, ah. oh come on. You could have totally caught that. You've mocked me long enough. Blouses and blouses, that was heavy. Now that was all hand. How? Okay, go deep. Dun, 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 dun. Go deep? Oh, I thought we were playing catch. I mean, we could play a little football. You think I'm here to play? Show me, mortal. Can you fly? Can I fly? Is that loco? It's a hammer. I mean, I can probably hang up a frame or something. Wield lightning, then. Madre de la chupacabras. 
Wild Lightning is a hammer. Okay, do you know what? That was pretty cool. I traded you for mine. I'm not trading you. Mine is super nice, though. It's really good quality. I've only used it one time for a year. Where'd you get it? Home Depot. Home Depot? I've never heard of it. Is it anything like Asgard? Maybe. It's probably more expensive, though. But you can probably get a credit card and get like 5% off your first purchase. Does your hammer help you fly? How about we trade it? Maybe you test it out. Go take it out for a spin. Have your fun at it. It doesn't help you fly. <laughs> oh! Whoa, that was crazy. I think it's gonna rain or something. You think this is all a game, don't you? I might have read this all completely wrong, but I thought you were applying to work for my company. You think I want to be a hot gardener? Well, I mean, you're not very fond on the eyes, but yeah, I can hire you part-time and give you some dental benefits as long as you go down to Mexico and for any dental work and see my cousin Beto, cash only, please. I've had enough of this. How about you get back to work? What? Oh, I'm sorry, my friend. Only those who are worthy can pick up the shovel. You can start in the weeds and you can pick up your hammer after your shift. You know you're gonna love working here? Great dental benefits. Bro, Lonzo Ball. Who's that? I don't know, you know what, I'm just trying to be cool. David. You said that you would clean up the garage and take out the trash yesterday. Yeah, I'll do it later. No, you'll do it now. Thank you. So you just let her talk to you like that? No. You know what? I'm going to tell her, don't tell me what to do. Oh, you're going to tell her that? Yeah, I'm going to go and say, hey, listen, don't tell me what to do. OK. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Woo. Great practical job, Jim. Got me going to the annex. What was that? Oh, no, it's just nothing. It's just he's Eric. He's being dumb. Hello? Yo, did you tell her yet? <laughs> I'm gonna tell her. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell her. I'm just waiting for the right time, the right moment. You know what I mean? I know what you're saying. All right, late, man. Yeah. What was that? Oh, <laughs> nothing. Really What? Ah! <sighs> All right, ready to roll? Oh yeah, hey, let me get a piece of gum. This is actually my last piece. Really? Mm-hmm. Prove it. What? Prove that that's your last piece of gum. Do you not believe me? I think it's convenient that all of a sudden when I ask for a piece of gum that that's your last piece. You don't believe me? You think I'm lying to you? Yeah, I do. I think you're Why you're would I lie to you about you're that? you're a filthy, dirty liar, man. I'm a filthy, dirty yeah. liar. Yeah, you are. Because you won't give me a piece of gum, and I know you have it. It's my last piece. You're gonna if I had this. another piece, I'd give you a piece. You know see, that. Okay, you know what? Let me see the pack of gum. David, we've been friends for 15 years. Yeah, like that matters now. Oh, it matters. No, it doesn't. I was the first guy who held your child. You held... Yeah. yeah. Before you. How did that... I... I don't know, did How I? How did that even happen? Who cares, Matt? Let me see that pack of gum. Prove to me that you care about I this friendship. Was, I was your best man in your wedding, David. Okay, well, now I'm gonna lie to you about a stick of gum? You need to prove to me that our friendship is worth it by showing me that pack. You wanna see it? I wanna see that pack you wanna right see that now. Pack? Give it to me. Let go. I'm in. You're let, let go. I'm let go. You're holding on to me. Give it to me. Jeez. See? You know what? I'm sorry. It's okay. I knew you were my best friend. I mean, <laughs> How'd that get in there? What is that? It's a lot of gum. Little, no, I think it's like silver, silver bars or something else. It can't be. The... That's a lot of. That's a lot of gum. I'm sorry. You can have a piece here. Do you want a piece? I don't know. Get away. I don't know, man. I like my cheesecake with a little bit of mayonnaise. Oh, that sounds horrible. Oh, look out! How did you do that? What are you talking about? I, ah, did you, ah. you just stopped that car with one hand. 
you must be in shock right now. I think we're both in shock. I mean, this is wild. He just hit me with the scar. <gasps> Are you guys okay? I'm so sorry. He literally just stopped your truck with one hand. Don't listen to him. He's in shock right now. Look at him blabbering him away. He doesn't know what he's talking about. You know what you did? You hit me and my ribs are all broken, but my adrenaline is through the roof right now. Can't feel a thing. So let me tell you what. We're going to let this one slide, okay? Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, get in your car. It's okay. Come on. Come on, buddy. Just get out of here. I don't remember bumping my head. That's the thing. You're not going to remember something like that. I guess. Then let's just stop talking about it. Hey, give me your wallet. How did you do that? I mean, what are you talking about? Oh! I think you killed him. Oh, look at that. He's on me. He must know jujitsu. Oh, Khabib. Oh, no, I'll put him to sleep. Clout Joe Rogan, get him over here. This is ridiculous. How do you keep doing these crazy things? Yeah. Did you see that? I totally got him in an arm triangle and put him to sleep. No, you literally knocked him five feet in the air and slammed him on the ground. Oh, you must still be in shock from that car accident earlier. I'm not in shock. I know what I saw. Relax. There is nothing going on. Let's go. None of this is making any sense. You're literally breaking the laws of physics. Oh, heads up. I mean, whoa! I can't believe they sell these things to kids! Give me those. Be careful with those bad boys. I mean, oh, you're burning me! Oh! Would you please tell me how you're doing all those crazy things? Oh, come on. You know what I think is crazy? That we almost got hit by a car, robbed by someone, and hit by a baseball all within the same time frame. I mean, I'm more concerned about how all these things are happening at once than the random possibility that I'm a superhero. It is kind of crazy how all these things are happening at once. Right? That's what's weirding me out. It's like someone's planning all of this. That's what I'm saying. Maybe someone is causing all of this to happen. I don't know. But we need to focus on that more than my oddly great reflexes and potential superhuman strength. I am. What? Why didn't you tell me you were a superhero? What? I'm not a superhero, I'm a supervillain. I thought we were friends! How could you hide this from me? Me? You're the one who's hiding superhero powers from me! I don't know what you're talking about. You must have bumped your head! You are so stubborn! <sighs> How did you just absorb all of that? Oh, I mean, ah! Wow. Get me! LeBron, let's go, baby. Let's go. Which way am I gonna go? What am I gonna do? 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 Whoa! Fuck it, baby! That's a travel. What? What are you talking about? That was like 10 steps. I don't know what you just saw, but that wasn't 10 steps. How could you get from top of the key to the hoop in less than 10 steps? There's no way. Come on, man. You know I did. Don't hate on my moves. All right, do it again. Show me what you just did. Okay. All right, let's do this. Okay, got it like this. Got it like this. Woo. Easy money. You literally just did the same thing. You're only allowed to take two steps. Okay, Boomer. What? You're stuck in the old ways. I'm the new generation, baby. And when did the rules change from two steps to ten? Okay, let me explain this to you, okay? First and foremost, have you ever heard of a gather step? A what? Gather step. So as I'm picking up the ball, I get a gather step before my steps even start. Show me. Boom. Boom. Take a gather step. Those don't even count. Wow, uh, okay. Even with taking those two steps out, you're still taking like six steps. I'm getting there. All right, go. Then you take another step but it's a Euro step, and everyone knows those don't even count. I've never heard anyone say those don't count. Then you gotta step, you know, stomp the yard once for respect. You know, you gotta get respect. Then that's when your progress actually starts. You see? So, one, two, and one for good luck. One for good luck? Yeah, man, it's all perfectly legal. No, it's not. You're just a hater. You're sticking to the old ways. Basketball evolves. Evolves into what, a step class? Haven't you ever seen the movie Happy Feet? Yeah, I have. What does that have to do with anything? It's a good movie. Yeah, but that doesn't explain anything at all. You know what? Check up, my ball anyway. What, why? You hit me. What? Let's
that's a foul. There's no hand checking in basketball. I wasn't even gonna call it until you got all soft on me. I barely touched you. So it'll still be a foul in the NBA, WNBA, the CIA, the FBI, UPS. You're not even making any sense now. You know what? I'm done playing with you. I'm gonna go play with some real ballers. NBA 2K, baby. Peace. Hey, that's my ball. How's this for a travel? <laughs> Ooh. Okay, what is it? There's a monster under my bed. Are you serious? How old are you? Just check, please. Okay, fine. Okay. <sighs> Why did you do that? <laughs> well, because there's no such thing as monsters. I can't get up. Dang it, Grandpa! Hey, we're gonna need your car. And you're gonna need this glove. What? What do we need a glove for? Oh, it looks like you have something behind your ear. Hey, mamma mia! From behind my waddles! Hey, what are you, some kind of wizard or something like that? Uh, Harry Styles? Don't you mean Harry Potter? Aren't they the same guy? One's a musician and one's a magician. All right, Dumbledore. What are you gonna do next? Pull a rabbit out of his eye? Hey, forget about it. First, pick card. Boss, can I? Yeah, go ahead, make it quick. Memorize it. Okay, got it? Yeah. Now put it back in the deck. He's gonna pull a rabbit out of my ear or something. He ain't gonna pull no rabbit out of your ear. What do you mean? He's a magician. He can do whatever he wants. Why would a rabbit be doing in your ear, rabbit brains? Now hand me your hat. You're off your rocker, Harry Trent. Come on, boss. I'm too invested. Ugh. All right, botcha gloop. Batter up. Whoa, I'll bat out of a hat! Kiss it each! How'd you do that? Hey! You're full of nonsense, Harry. Wait, that's not my card. Yeah, what did you do with his card? Batter. Check what you're holding. Get out of here. Is that your card? No way! Forget about Forget it! About hey, it. somebody get this boy coffee! You got me spooked! Hey, you got the man spooked! Now for my last trick. Batter up. Don't think I'm gonna take it easy on you just because you're a magician. I'm the great Bambino. More like the great Bambi. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, I told you, I'll wrap it right out of the hat. That's a glove, you jabroni. He's got a dog in there. This guy's like Mary Poppins. Mary who? Don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> out of the park. Looks like you're out of tricks, Houdini. The show is over. But you just bought your tickets. What does he mean we bought our tickets? Get out of here.
Ay, estos niños nunca aprenden. I didn't think you'd show up. I ain't afraid of nothing, Ese. That's not true. Ronnie, what are you doing here? You are afraid, fool. Of the dark. What? No, I'm not, fool. And you afraid of spiders. I ain't no afraid of no spiders. Itsy bitsy spider went up the vato's leg. Hey! Come on, man, let's just do this! He's also afraid of really tight spaces. Oh, he's a claustrophobic little baby. I ain't afraid of you, though. Yeah, but you're afraid of rejection. <laughs> you ain't invited to the kickback, fool. All right, all right. Let's slow it down now. Why? Because you're scared of public speaking? Oh, speech, 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 <laughs> speech, Stop speech, it. Stop that, fool. This fool's crying now. You're weak, Essay. <laughs> I ain't afraid of no knife, though. You afraid of clowns, though? Hey! Let me get a payaso wig, Essay. Put this on, Essay. Yeah. Okay, fools, you're taking it too far. No, 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 no. Let's stop it right here, fools. Come on. Da 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 I invited my big brother, Limon, and he ain't afraid of nothing. Limon. Wait, what? <laughs> some weaknesses this year. Hey, Dad. Ooh. Can I have a cookie? Not right now. You haven't ate dinner. Okay. I'm gonna cry now. Please don't cry. Cookie, then. Fine. Go. Okay, thanks, Pops. Owie. Anyways, man, they were cruising all year. Owie. Don't look at him or else he'll cry. Owie.
Joey, I failed! Just ignore him. He won't cry. Okay. I said owie! Um, yeah, honestly, I think I think they're just gonna repeat. Owie, I failed! Just ignore him. He'll stop. Okay, um... Look at me! I just... Look at me! Uh, this is getting weird. Honestly, if you just ignore him, he'll stop. All right. Did you not just see what happened back there? Look at me. Don't look at him. I'm trying not to. Come on. Give me a little look, see. He's gonna kill me. He's not gonna do anything. I'm gonna kill you. <gasps> hey man, relax. I'm not gonna let you relax until the day you look at me. <laughs> I gotta pee. Is anyone home? Oh, sweet free food and Netflix for me. <laughs> Dude, you are so funny. I mean... I know. What's going on here? Oh, hey Juan, I didn't hear you come in. Who's this guy? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't introduce you guys. John, this is Juan. Juan, this is John. Nice to meet you. Hey, isn't Juan... Spanish for John? No, I'm pretty sure John is English for Juan. I'm left-handed. Yeah, but I'm always right. I mean, I'm right-handed. Hmm. So Juan, Josh tells me you're a residential landscaper. Oh really? He never mentions you. Well, I do landscaping myself, except I do mostly commercial landscaping, you know, the big stuff. And I leave the residential jobs to the smaller stash. I mean, staff. How do you know Josh? Oh, we go way back. We've been friends since elementary school. He's like a brother to me. How about you? He adopted me for a day, so he's pretty much like a father to me. Oh. Thanks, Juan. Can't get the feel. You're the worst dad ever. So what are you guys doing Saturday night? Maybe you and your dad can come to my comedy show. I'm a stand-up comedian. Oh man, Juan, you should hear him. He is so funny. He's he's like the funniest guy I know. Yeah, he looks like a real joke to me. What's your problem? What's your problem? I don't have a problem. I don't have a problem. Hey, is everything cool here? I'm good. I'm better. Okay, how about I just make a little coffee for everyone, all right? Sure, I'll take Folgers if you got it. Folgers? No manches! What is this, 1996? The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. You might as well go outside and grab some dirt and stick it in the cup. Get me some rico cafecito, some cafe bustelo. I'd rather have chocolate milk than that. Chocolate milk? What are you, five years old? Get me a real man's drink. Dad, get me some champurado! Well, we've only got this store-bought coffee. Get Shut up! up! You know what? Why don't you give me some organic coffee beans and I'll pop on my Skittles? Better Jet, why don't you go down to Oaxaca? My cousin owns a farm there. Ask him for a coffee plant, bring it here, and I'll chew it from the stem. Um, I don't think I have time for that. I told you you were a horrible dad! Yeah, you're not even a good friend! Hey, nobody talks to that Osaka bones like that except me! Thanks, son. Cállate la boca! I don't know what that means but it sounds endearing. I bet you're not even a good landscaper. I'm the biggest commercial landscaping company in the city. Oh, that's cute. I'm the biggest landscaping company in the universe. Gardeners of the galaxy, baby. Yo soy Josh. What are you even talking about? They'd be like, Juan, can you teach me how to garden? You know that all the neighbors love me. People fear me. Pues estás feo. What? Don't you wish your gardener was hot like me? Don't you wish your gardener pulled weeds like me? That's it. Let's see who's the best landscaper right here, right now. Fine by me. I'm gonna get my tools. How long are you gonna let him do this? 
Hasta que prenda. You were supposed to help me with that. Don't worry, I'm taking care of it. You ready? Yeah, I think so. You think? Come on, rookie, you better be ready. No, I mean, I, I'm ready. I, I'm ready. Okay, good. Because these guys, they can smell a cop the moment he walks through the door. Guess I shouldn't have eaten donuts this morning then, huh? That's not funny, man. Get serious. All right. My bad. Remember, let me do the talking. We're in, I ask a few questions, and then we're out. I got it. Okay, good. Let's go. Why are you so nervous? I can't help it, man. Come on. You know what? I'm a little nervous too. Get me. Okay. Can I help you? We're here to see Mr. Cornelius. Are you guys cops? Of course not. Then why do you smell like donuts? Well... <laughs> <laughs> the classic cop donut choke. <laughs> you can't go wrong with that one. I thought you said that wasn't funny. Shut up! Are you gonna let us in? I know Mr. Cornelius' time is precious. Of course. Come in. Good to see you again, James. Pleasure's all mine. Who's the new guy? He's just an associate of mine. Oh, so you think you can walk in here and bring an associate and expect me to trust you? How long have we been working together? And now you're starting to question me? You work for me. I work for no man. Prove to me that he's not a cop, right now. Come on, man, what was that for? I had to prove you're not a cop. There's plenty of other ways you could have proven that. Yeah, I could think of a few other ways. See? You know what, I'm sorry. It's the first thing that came to mind. Look, man, is that enough? You believe I'm not a cop? I have something to see some ID. Here. Nice. Gregory? Yeah. With a name like that, you're very punchable. I can see why he did. See? It's not my fault. Whatever. We've wasted enough time, okay? I came here to purchase from you. Very well. I assume you have my payment. I wouldn't have come here without it. Remember, once you buy from me, there's no going back. There's no going back for both of us. FBI, you're under arrest! What? What do you mean, what? You're under arrest! No, I'm not under arrest! You're under arrest! You're FBI? We're both FBI! We've been planning this thing from the beginning! I've been working on this case for months! Are you serious? Serious! Let me see your badge. Let me see your badge. You are FBI! Son of a gun! So are you! This is awkward. Hey, those are the real criminals. FBI, you're under arrest! Actually, we're Homeland Security. Wait, both of you? Yeah. yeah. So you're telling me every single person in this room is undercover? That's what it looks like. We've been working on a fake case for months. Um, actually, it's, it's my first day, to be honest. Shut, Shut up, up, Gregory! You know what? This is the worst. Can't get any worse than this. LAPD, you're under arrest! Oh, come on! Excuse me, sir. I have a great opportunity for you. We're selling protein shakes at an all-time low price. Are you serious? Not only that, if you sign up today, you can start selling your own protein shakes. No way. You can make a ton of money. And not only that, if you sign up a friend as well, you can make a ton of money off of his sales. That sounds so good. And if he signs someone up as well, you can make money off of him. And then if he signs someone up, you can make money off of him as well. You can make a ton of money. That is crazy. So what do you think? It starts with one easy payment of $19.99. Okay. Here's the thing, I don't have any money. You don't have any money? Zero, no money. I spent it all yesterday, okay? Nothing left. Really? But I do have a really nice shovel. You see, this shovel is super nice, and you can buy it off of me for 20 bucks. I don't really need a shovel. And I can sign up for your program, and then you get money off of me. And then if I sign someone up, you get money off of him. And if he signs someone up, you get money off of him. You make all kinds of money. I guess. Okay, 20 bucks, thank you. Thank you. Here you go. Yeah, thanks. You know what? I, I'm so sorry. I, I just remember, um, 
I need gas money. I'm just gonna hold on to this 20 and I'll sign up for your program next week. Hey! What are you doing with my shovel? Oh man. Boom. This game's so dumb. It's your game. It's your game. Dude, relax. I'm sorry, dude. I'm hungry. Let's just go get Alberta's. I'm down. Their tacos are so good. Hey, hey, hey. What's that? Oh man. It's my budget app. Your budget app? Yeah, it's to keep track of my expenses and help me manage my money. Hey, where do you think you're going, Bato? Alberto's to grab some tacos with Adam? Psh, that's gonna be enough for you, dog. <laughs> I can afford tacos. You know you can't afford to buy them or eat them. Maybe jog around the block a little bit. You're getting poquito gordo. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna uninstall this app. You can't do that either. Once you install it, you can't escape. You should have read the fine print, Mendigo. What kind of budget app is that? Could have just downloaded Mint. I did have Mint, but every month I was going over budget and the app was just like, try better next time, we believe in you, and I kept going over budget. So I needed something a little more strict. Well, it seems like you downloaded a virus. Hey, mind your own business. Maybe if you had a budget app like me, you could afford a real haircut. Whoa, come hey, on now. Dude. You know what? Let's just go get tacos. I don't even care. I didn't want to have to do this. Do what? Okay, senora. Señora? ¿Qué estás haciendo? ¿Por qué vas a comprar comida afuera? Ma? Hay mucho arroz y frijoles en el refri. Ya no te estés gastando tu dinero. Y ya vente a la casa a levantar tus calzones zurrados del baño. Okay, you know what? Stop, 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 stop. Have you had enough? Yes, I won't get tacos. <sighs> es todo. Well, I'm gonna go get tacos. Can you spot me? I I'll pay you back. No, he won't. What? Y yes, I will. Oh, really? Hey, lay off a little. I believe him. Thank you. Okay, I warned you. What now? David? Who is this? This is Josh. Juan just reminded me that you owe me 20 bucks. Could I get that from you, please? Oh, um, you David, cannot, you'll never you... pay me back. You owe my son Evan 20 bucks as well. Maybe it's time to go home and eat some leftovers. <sighs> All right. I can't afford to go out to eat or borrow money right now. I'm sorry, my friend. He's not sorry, he's embarrassed. Would you stop? Don't blame me, you downloaded the app. It's true. You gotta admit, it's pretty effective. Yeah, it works great. You know what, how about, how about you drive, I'll, I'll buy. Yes, thank you. <laughs> <sighs> I appreciate you doing this. It's all good, cuz. <sighs> I need gas. The only gas you're gonna get is from your mom's beans. I can afford gas. It's in the budget. Ja, and you used it all up driving to buy coffee you can't afford. Cappuccino for un cochino. I already told him I can give him a ride. Well, he better like piggy box ride then. Do you want a piggy? No. Oh, I was just kidding. I'm gonna go now. That's good because we can't afford you either. What? Just kidding. That one's free on the house. I'll be here all week. Actually, I'm installing this phone forever. I'll see you later, man. All right, man. See you later. <sighs> I've been spending most my life living off my mama's beans and rice. Okay, fine. What's wrong, man? My girlfriend broke up with me, man. Ah, the first cut is the deepest. It's definitely painful. But you know, as I always say, misters before sisters. I don't think I've ever heard you say that before. I'm pretty sure I made it up. I'm pretty sure you didn't. Okay, you know what? Listen, tonight we're gonna go have some fun so you can get over this girl that is too good for you. Wow. And while she's out, Flirting with every single guy in the world. They're looking for a real man to take care of. Juan, how is any of this helping? What I'm saying is you and me, fun, pizza, ice cream, burritos, picking up my dry cleaning, video games, cleaning up my room, doing some prank calls, and more video games all tonight. So much fun. Thanks, Juan. You know, I'm actually starting to feel a little bit better, man. So, what do you want to do first? Wait, what? Us hanging out tonight. That's tonight? Yes, you literally just planned it. We did? Who just texted you? Just my dentist. It was Juanita, wasn't it? Jess. I knew it. Because she's my dentist. Juan, she's not your dentist. She is my dentist. I have cavities. Prove it. Okay, look. Where? 
Can you at least look at me? Juan, where, what cavity? He's cavities? in the far left. Where? He's in the far left corner. Can you, can you, Juan, quit playing your games. I know you're ditching me for Juanita. Mm, I wouldn't call it ditching it because we, uh, we didn't really have plans. So what happened to the pizza, the ice cream, the video games? That never happened. I don't even remember saying any of that stuff. That doesn't sound like me. What happened to Misters Before Sisters? I don't even know what that means. You said you made it up. I say a lot of things that don't make sense. It's your fault for taking it to heart. What? Oh, uh, I gotta go with my dentist. It's not your dentist. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry. Fine. Tonight, me and you, we're gonna have fun because you know it is true. Misters Before Sisters. Thanks, Juan. You know, that really means a lot to me, man. What? Nothing. Are we gonna go? Um, go, go where? Come on. Again? Yep. All I have to say is clingy. Hello? I miss you too, Arlo. You miss me? I mean, I knew you would, but to hear you say... It just sounds so good. Yep. Um, did you need something? When are you coming home? Arlo, I told you about ten minutes ago that I wouldn't be home till later today. Oh, yeah. You just say that. But I miss you right now. I know. Um, Arlo, I have to go. I'll, I'll see you later, okay? Okay. I'll call you back in ten minutes. No, Arlo! <sighs> see? That is why I have a cat. Come on, man. It's not that bad. It's, it's probably an emergency. <laughs> ha! Emergency! Wow. See? It is an emergency! Yeah, okay, buddy. Hello? Hello? Arlo? Hey, uh, what's going on? You said it was an emergency. Yes, David. Okay, so I found something strange in your closet. Oh, really? What did you find? A tarantula! A tarantula? Yes! And get this! It looks just like your shoe! <gasps> Wait, the tarantula looks just like my shoe? Yes, David. It looks just like your shoe, but I swear it was a tarantula, and I chewed it all up for you. Wow. Okay, and um, how exactly does the tarantula look just like my shoe? You know what I'm thinking? It could be that new species Danny the Chihuahua next door was talking about. Danny the Chihuahua is a filthy liar. You know that, Arlo. Okay, just stay out of my closet. Okay. I promise it will never, ever, ever happen again. Never, ever, 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 ever. I love you. I love you too, okay? All right, bye. Okay, bye. <sighs> Hello? Hi, what you doing? Mom, just getting gas. Wow, that sounds like so much fun. Remember that one time we got gas? I do. It was amazing. Yeah, it was amazing. <laughs> oh, who was that? Oh, it's just some random dog. You're with another dog. No, I'm not with the other dog. How could you after everything we've I'm not with the other dog. Another dog just happens to be here. I'm hanging up, and I'm not calling you back for at least five minutes. <sighs> wow. I haven't heard from my cat all day. <sighs> Hello. Hey, Charlie, how are you? I haven't heard from you today. What do you guys want to watch? Just put on the game. Alright. Turn on the game. Let me hit the bathroom real quick. I'll be back in a second. Dude, his remote, it's magic. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You just saw him turn it on with his voice. It's probably one of those voice remote things. No, it's not. I know it's magic. We can test yeah, it out. Yeah, sure. Let's sure. test it out. Let's see. Oh, okay. okay. Let's see. Alright. Bring me pizza. It's not gonna be pizza. You never know. Pizza? I knew it! Well, you still have to pay for it. I don't wanna pay for the pizza. Well, you don't have to pay for it. 
I'm sorry, I doubt I do. It's okay. Wait, I have an idea. What is it? Hold on, I'm having a moment. Okay, let's go. Woo, that was, uh... Hey, where's David? He's outside. What's he doing outside? He's using your magic remote. Magic remote? What magic remote? The one that we ordered pizza with? The pizza that I ordered earlier? Yeah, but we didn't have to pay for it. Yeah, because I already paid for it online. Oh. Serious and full of tricks. Sunny Bang, tricks are for kids. But I came to fight, not put on a show. Oh, that was a cheap move. What? Come on, Ramses, you're number one. Ramses, who are you? I'm Juan. How long have you been sitting there? Like 20 minutes or something. 20 minutes? How do we not notice you? It's because I'm like a sneaky squirrel. And why are you sitting there watching us? I thought this was a Lucha Libre fight. Lucha Libre? It is a style of professional wrestling in Mexico. That's right, Ramses. You're number one. Why do you keep calling me Ramses? I thought you were Ramses, the famous luchador coming back with vengeance. No, I'm not. I'm Bane, and I'm here to destroy him. Okay, then. It's more like it. Andale Bane Dulce, some of those luchador moves. You need to leave. This is not a show. If this is not a show, why are you in a costume and talking like that? Because I'm Batman. Okay, relax, man. Are you part bat? Part man or something? No, I'm fully human. Well, then you're just a dude in a bat suit, then. What? Now, Spider-Man. That is super cool. A man with real spider abilities. Because he is a man, but then he's like part spider. He's crawling up on walls and everything. It's super cool. You should check him out. You know, he's making a lot of sense right now. Wow. Hey, woman. Ah! That's Bane and Batman. I told you. We're watching the fight. No, you told me we were watching a free luchador match. You're inviting people to watch us? Hey, beggars can't be choosers. You literally have two fans right now. Your show is not very good at all. Juan, we need to get out of here. No thanks. I want to see what bot suit dude can do. Listen, this is getting weird and awkward for all of us. You guys better get out of here, or you're going to be in some serious danger. Ow! Oh! You see, if that guy had body senses, he would have seen that coming. Now for the hecklers. Who wants to lose first? Juan, why are you always getting me in these dangerous predicaments? It's a dangerous predicament every day you wake up. I mean, you walk down the stairs is dangerous. That's true. Just the other day, I sneezed and my back went out. You know what? I bet when you were young, you were a real William Wallace. I did wrestle in high school for four years. See? You're molding just a fragile old Gumby. And I did jujitsu for a couple years in my 20s. Then what happened? I don't know. I just stopped trying. I like the old you better. Wait, the old me or the old me? If you don't come down here, I'll come and get you myself. Well, I guess we're gonna have to go one at a time then. Wait, I'm tired of not trying anymore. What? I've given up far too early, and I'm done. You're done being done? Yes, and I'm waking up early every day from now on. I'm working out, I'm cleaning my garage, I'm brushing my teeth. Please. I'm taking my wife out on a date. I'm taking my kids to the game, and I am finally unclogging that upstairs toilet. You may take our lives, but you will never take our freedom! <laughs> Okay, now that's a surprise. Ah! This just doesn't seem right. <laughs> he was sandbagging. How do you like the show now? Are you not entertained? Now those were some real luchador moves. How about we try this again? This time, it will be for real. <laughs> You're back! And who are you? I'm back one. Oh, are you part bat, part one? Okay, here we go. Salty much? What? You can't just take my line like that, my guy. Yeah, that was pretty lame. Yeah. You straight up just copied me. Are you serious? Like, stop trying to be me. You're just so obsessed. I'm not trying to be you. You're trying to be me. You want to be me so bad. You want to be me so bad. See, you're copying me again. <sighs> Fine then, let's go! See what you got, B! 
fat dude? Oh, I'm going to enjoy this. There we go. Problem solved. What? How'd you do that? I've dodged chanclas all my life. That was nothing. You mean to tell me you planned that? Pretty much. Why? Because that's how you put on a show. Wow. Do you want to be me so bad? Let's get out of here. Ugh. You risked your life for me, Juan. Well, you owe me 20 bucks, and I'm going to need a ride home. I guess that's still pretty nice. Don't get used to it. No, 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 Batman! There's a rumor going around, vatos, that our gang is getting soft. And we can't have that. So we need to step up our game and start to run this city. Don't move, fool. Why, vato? Madre de la chupacabras. Hey, fool, you got arachnophobia. What, fool? I ain't afraid of Iraq, vato. Nah, it means you're afraid of spiders. You think I'm afraid of a little itsy bitsy spider? Got it off. Fool, you should have seen your face. You were tripping out. You were. You are scared of a little spider. I told you, fool, I'm not scared of no little spider. Maybe you are getting a little soft. What, fool? Don't tell him, fool. His old heart might go out. Tell me what? It's all you, fool. <laughs> go check if he's okay. You go check. What are you scared? No, you're scared. You think I'm scared? Man, what all them go check since you can flex? Okay, I'll check. Hey, Reaper, are you alive? Is that fool dead? He looks dead. Fool, he's been looking dead. Shake him up a little bit. All right, all right. Oh, it went up my sleeve, fool! Yeah, it went up. Ah, I can feel it in my back, man. Ah, save me, Michael, save me! Relax, relax, fool! I don't think it's on you anymore! Are you sure, fool? Yeah, look! It's over there by Reaper! What, do, what are we gonna do? What we should have done from the beginning. You right! It's just a little spider, fool! You got this! I thought that much over colors. What happened, Vato? I make out the spider, eh? I told you, fool! I ain't afraid of no itsy bitsy spider. Look who left! It's a whole gang of them! Ah! Oh, Vato, run! <laughs> Did you just throw your banana peel at me? Did you just throw, um... It's a tamale wrap. Oh, chicken tamale to get technical. I've never heard of it. Oh, it's super delicious, to be honest. Sounds a delicious. Anyways, who are you? It's -a me, Mario. Do I know you or something? No. Why? Because you just said, it's -a me, Mario, like I'm supposed to know you or something. No, that's just how I introduce myself. Oh, okay then. It's -a me, Juanito. Okay, Juanito, do you want to go? Actually, it's just Juan. Then why did you say it's a me, Juanito? Because you said Mario, and I thought Juanito just rang better. I don't know, I guess, whatever. That's a little weird. You're weird. It looks like you're on the way to unclog my toilet. What? It looks like you're on your way to mow my lawn. Whoa, that is racist. Well, are you a gardener? Maybe. Are you? Yes, but I'm a super hot gardener, okay? Yes, if hot meant super ugly. Maybe if you grow a real mustache like me, you'd be good looking. Oh, so all I need is a bigger mustache to be good looking. You're saying all my other features are perfect, huh? That's not what I meant. Do you know what? I'll take it as a compliment. Well, you might as well draw your mustache on with a sharpie. It's a so tiny. What did you say? So tiny. You take that back. It took me years to grow a real mustache. Oh, that's a big talk from a mini stash. Or is that your mom's mascara on your upper lip? Okay, you know what? That's it. Let's go right here, right now. That's a fine by me. <gasps> Splinter's gonna be so mad at you.
Ah, so you do have a tricks. Oh, don't be shellfish. Show me what else you got. Oh, I definitely have more up my sleeve. Yeah, probably a plunger. Too bad your mustache can't save you, buddy, because behind all that stash, you're nothing but an empty shell. That's it! Now you will see true power! <gasps> no manches! Brujeria! Everybody loves Inote. Out of shape, plumber. Why am I not surprised? Well, you just all talk anyways. Yes, I am a pretty good talker. That is true. But let me see. I'm um, okay. Check it out. Oh, yeah, right here. You know what? Maybe not as cool as yours, but effective nonetheless. And I used to love these when I was a kid. What are those? Oh, you're going to find out. Wait. I'm sorry! Ah! Woo! <laughs> Wait, that's it? What do you mean that's it? A little build up for a couple of poppers. Yeah, pretty much. But super fun though. You're so pathetic. Maybe, but not as pathetic as your reaction. What? Your all bark, no bite. Hey, Pedro. Did you get that all on camera? Yeah, I got the whole thing. Ah, woo, <laughs> Wait, you better not show that to anyone. Your mustache can't save you now, buddy. Oh, no. Oh, please, no. I will do anything. Thanks. He's been clogged for weeks. I bet I can beat you at something. Oh, really? What? Hey, Carlos, you got an ibuprofen or something? My head is killing me. Nah, Holmes, but I got something better. Oh, I like the sound of that. I got these essential oils. You a pastor now, fool? Nah, fool, not anointing oils, essential oils. What are essential oils? It's like a compound extracted from plants. Is that even legal, fool? Yeah, it's legal. It's way better for you, too. Okay then, compa, hook me up. I got you, Essay. I got this peppermint oils. How much does this run for, fool? It's about 50 bucks. What, fool? Is that what they poured on Jesus' feet? Nah, hey, it's just really potent. Watch. Okay, man. Hey, how's that feel? To be honest, it feels like my temple and my eyeballs are on fire, fool. Hey, that just means it's working, eh? <sighs> There's nothing essential about these oils, they say. What's up, homies? I got the food for the kickback today. Did you grab my gluten-free buns, I say? I got you, I say. What are gluten-free buns? Get this. It's like buns without the gluten. Gluten-free buns. Okay. But what is gluten? To be honest, I really don't know. I just know it's bad for you. Is there gluten in essential oils? Nah, nah, nah. Hey, gluten is a protein found in wheat, and it's like bad for you. Okay then, well at least tell me you got me regular buns. Nah, fool, you don't want none of that. I got lettuce though, I can make your mean lettuce red. What, do I look like a freaking conejo, fool? Hey, hey, relax, Jaime. Hey, we just looking out for you. You're stressing me out, that's what you're doing, fool. I got an essential oil for stress, Holmes. Do you have an essential oil for being stupid? I actually do. Oh my goodness. Okay, you know what? Just give me a soda or something. Hey, fool. Take this. Thanks, fool. Man, I was thirsty. <laughs> what is this? It tastes like straight cut pee. It's kombucha. What did you call me, fool? Nah, I said it's kombucha. I ain't no one's kombucha, essay. Nah, fool. I'm saying the drink is kombucha, not you. Oh, you're right, man. This one's rotten or something. This is straight kombucha. Man, do you, do you even know what kombucha is? Isn't it the opposite of Akuna Matara? Nah, fool. Kombucha is a fermented drink. You fermented gut pee? No, it's a, it's a healthy drink, fool. <sighs> Come on, man. Stop giving me your brujeria potions, fool. Hey, Jaime, you want some celery juice? You're selling me juice? N nah, celery juice. Hillary's goose? Nah, fool. Celery juice. It's like juice, but like celeries. You're telling me that you're juicing celery sticks? Yeah, it's good for you, fool. Come on, fool. What's next? We're gonna start milking almonds? <laughs> almonds. I mean, you don't actually milk the almonds like you would a cow. Are you serious, fool? Uh, yeah. That actually sounds pretty good, fool. Let me get some almonds. I got you, Holmes. Hey, 
Aren't you a little old for a lemonade stand? Aren't you a little old to be alive? I'll show you old. Oh, oh. dang it, Juan. You know I wasn't gonna do anything. That's my bad. Ugh. Okay, but why do you have a lemonade stand? It's not mine, it's my nephew's. Jesus? No, his name is Juanito. I don't think I've met him. Yeah, my sister's making me watch him because he's like a troublemaker or something. Well, that's very honorable of you. Yeah, I'm pretty much just making him work for me and I'm gonna take all the money and buy myself some new jeans. I'd probably do the same thing. You would, you scumbag. What? Oh, there he is. Whoa! Hola. Well, he looks just like you. That's racist. No, I mean, I can see the family resemblance. Excuse me, senor. Do you want to buy some lemonade? No, thanks, buddy. I just had some coffee. Then why are you wasting my time then? Ah, Juanito! No, it's all right. You know what? I'm going to take care of this. Híjole! That'll ay, teach you. Ay, That'll ay, teach you. Ay, That'll no teach you. Uh, Don't worry. His mom gave me permission. Andale! 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 <laughs> okay, stop! I'm sorry, Senior Judge. I'm sorry you had to see that. It's okay, it's my fault. I should have just bought lemonade. Don't encourage him, Josh! I'm just saying, none of this would have happened if I had just bought lemonade. Don't tell me how to raise other people's kids! What are you talking about? 50 bucks for a lemonade? You drink it, you buy it. Yeah, but I didn't know it was 50 bucks. Do we have a problem here? Whoa, relax! That's it! I'm gonna paint your pumpies red! I'm out of here. Good! Leave! Just like my dad did! Juanito, are you acting like this because your dad left you? No, it's because that viejo over there won't buy any lemonade. Juanito, I know you're hurting. It's just... Hey, vato! I thought I told you this is my territory! That's what I thought, fool! Juanito, stop! And where did you even get so many bottles? Wait! I want to buy some lemonade. Josh, you don't have to do that. No, I want to. Could you pay for that guy that stole my lemonade too? You know, money can't buy happiness. But it could buy lots of video games and that makes me happy. Thanks, Josh. I guess the kid just needs a little love. I'm sure he's in good hands. Try safe, stupid. Here you go, Uncle Juan. It worked. That's right. Easy money. All right. So all we got to do is find clues to escape this room. Well, then it's a good thing I brought my handy dandy notebook. <laughs> really? What? Do you see a clue? You seriously brought clues? Yeah. We're in an escape room. <laughs> Blues, clues, blues, clues, clues. Whoa. Did you find something? Yeah, but I don't know what it means. Nice, dude, that's the test rack. Maybe it's a uh, space or uh, the space posters. Maybe there's some sort of code or something. Um, Isaiah? Yeah. What kind of escape room is this? I don't know, but we need to get out of here. That is the way out. I just opened that portal. Oh, no way. I'm free. What do you mean, free? I've been in this escape room for a thousand years. He must have not had a hand in dandy notebook. Thank you for freeing me. Now I must do what I was always meant to do. What is that? Destroy the multiverse. Okay, that was nuts. I have to stop him. What? I, no! This is far above us! We have nothing to do with this! This is my calling. No, it is not your calling. This is an escape room we just happen to be in. I, uh... I have to go. Wait, Dave, no! What is going on right now? <laughs> have you seen my dad? What? Who are you? How'd you even get in here? I just need my dad. Listen, kid, I can use my dad right about now, too. Oh, no. They found me. Who found you?
Give me the child. Yeah, man, don't gotta tell me twice. What? Isaiah? Uh, yeah? You must stand trial for the destruction of the multiverse. For what? You're coming with me. No, he's not. Dad! David? Yes, I have returned. Uh, where did you go? There's no time to explain. Son, you need to go tell the multiverse of what has taken place here today. They'll tell stories of you forever, Papa. I love you, my son. Me too. Run. That is so weird. You have been judged, and now you must be terminated. It's been a long time since our last battle. It was not much of a battle. I just want to go home. I have seen the multiverse, and I have become one with it. seems real easy for everyone to come and go except me. Isaiah, I am not here to hurt you. I'm here to set you free. What, you, you mean I can go? Yes, but you must fulfill your destiny. I have a destiny now? When your friend found the Tesseract, it released an unimaginable terror on the multiverse. None of this makes any sense. You are the savior of the multiverse. Now take this and save us all. That is the sword Excalibur, enchanted with the powers of the Infinity Stone. This is my destiny. Ah! Isaiah. I got you. Oh, dang it! Or am I gonna do what I love? That's what I'm here to do. To encourage you to do what you love. I'm gonna go around the room, and when I point at you, I want you to stand up and tell everyone what you would love to do. How about you? Don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. Okay. Um, I've always wanted to be an actor. And you can be! I want to be an architect. And you will be! Oh, this is exciting. How about you? I want to be a bank robber! Well, I've always loved stealing stuff when I was little. I took this guy's phone earlier, you know, wallets, phones, etc., like that, but I've always wanted to get the big one. I'm not quite understanding you. Okay, let me, do, let me uh, explain right here. Here we go. So this is a bank, and what I'm doing right here is I'm gonna come through the back, I gotta get a bonded truck, you know what I'm saying? And I get it right here to get to the vault. So you can see, take a quick look. I'm probably need some of you guys' help. And then I get right there and I say, give me all your money! Okay, that's something I would not condone. Why? You just said do what you love. This is what I love. Yes, but that's not what I meant. Then what did you mean? Because you should have been clear during your little speech. Little speech? Okay, I'm not going to get upset. Let's just try this again. Is there something else that you'd love to do? Yes, absolutely. Great. What is it? I want to be an assassin. What? A hitman. Check it out right here. You see, that's me. And what happens is someone has to hire me. I take cash only. It's not traceable. And then I go out. Boom! Right there. I get my little bow and arrow. One shot bandit. That's what they call me. Oh my gosh. When did you draw that? And why is it so detailed? Well, you see, that's me because I was hired by this guy to go out and get him. And why do I look like the guy who's hiring you? Because you look like a man that needs a job done. I don't need any business done. None. Oh, you're right. It's best we don't discuss business in front of anybody. What business? I like where you're going. There is no business. Okay, you know what? I'm not hiring this guy for anything. He is not hiring me for anything. Right, I'm not hiring you. You're right, you're not. Okay, stop doing that. Okay, let's all just relax and calm down right now. It's obvious Ricky here doesn't quite understand what's going on. All I know is that you said, do what you love, and now you're saying, don't do what you love. 
Which one is it, toots? Wow. I mean, he does have a point. Who, the maniac? Hey, that's highly offensive. You're looking like David Blaine and Tony Robbins had a baby. Wait, what if that's what he loves doing? Okay, this needs to stop now. This is the last time I'm gonna ask you, is there something else you would love to do? Yes, actually, I've always wanted to open up a restaurant. Yes, okay, wow, that's great. And I could sell pancakes to all my customers. That is something you should do. And then I would rob them blind with identity theft. Okay, you can just get out of here. Fine! But I'm not gonna be calling this guy for business that we haven't discussed. Just get out of here! Okay, fine! Jesus, gosh, man! This is David Robbins, Tim Robin Blaine wanna be Chris Angel, son of a gun! Did you really think you could defeat me? I've trained my whole life for moments like this. Today, you will fall at the hands of Saita Juan. Ah! No, my chest! It's brujeria! What are you doing? I can't get rid of the last line of dirt. It's impossible. That's a tough one. It keeps me humble. Whatever. Anyways, I'm hungry. You want to grab a bite to eat? That actually sounds fun. This season over. Honestly, Juan, if you train really hard and put your heart behind it, I could see you getting a kill in Fortnite soon. I've been waiting for you. No matches! It's La Llorona! Run! What? I'm, I'm not, not La Llorona! I knew that. I am Element, and I'm not from this world but I've come to conquer this world. So you're an illegal alien. What? Really? That's all you have to say to the most powerful villain in the entire universe? Hey, I won't tell if you don't. Enough! I'm actually here to defeat the so-called strongest hero in the world, Goat. Oh, this guy? Hey, why they call you the Goat anyways? It means greatest of all time. That's actually a pretty cool name. You're not going to do anything today, Bruja! Who's this guy? I don't know, maybe another illegal alien? Wow! No, no, I, I meant maybe he's with her. Guy insane! My name is Papi Chulo. I'm here to save the day. El Cinto, very powerful tool. You think a little belt could defeat me? Vámonos, Llorona! Help me! Aren't you the most powerful man in the world? They're all gonna know I'm fake. <laughs> and I took all the credit from Sidowan. Ah! Ah! Oh no. We have a big problem. I forgot my wallet at home. Can't you cover me again? Again? He's getting kinda suspicious, huh? I don't think that's our biggest problem right now. It's time to defeat the so-called strongest hero in the world. Can you do it later? I'm so hungry right now. Silence! You're not even worthy to speak to me. Wow, that was rude. Now it's time to fall at the hands of Element. You know what, we should just go back. The restaurant closes in like 15 minutes. What? Now I'm super hangry, and I'm going to take you serious. Consecutive normal, John Glass. Wow. He really is the strongest hero in the world. I used all my power and didn't even leave a scratch on him. What'd you do? Nothing. I was just moving super fast side to side with my chunkla. She pretty much ran into it herself. Are you serious? No, I'm hungry. Well, there's no point now. We're never going to make it to the restaurant before they close. What? Ready for this? Something we just gotta do. Let's do it. Isaiah! David, what's up? The sky. <laughs> uh, the sky is uh, definitely up. Yeah. yeah <laughs> so, what are we doing, bros? A little Fortnite? <laughs> Not today, man. We actually brought you in here to tell you something. What's up? Man, I'm hot. Nice to meet you, hot. I'm David, and the air is on. What's with you guys? That was hilarious! See, that's the thing. It, it wasn't, though. Okay, I'm not following. Look, we asked you to come over because we have to stop hanging out with you. What? You guys are joshing me, right? 
Who says Joshy me? Hey, chill out. I got this. Look, ever since you had kids, you, you turn into a dad. Well, you know what? That's normally what happens when you have kids. No, no that's, that's, that's not what I'm saying. Well, then what do you mean? You turn into a stereotypical dad. How? I mean, look at the way you're dressed. What? My wife says I look good. You're wearing a fanny pack. It's super convenient. It has my phone, my keys, my wallet, and my chapstick. Yeah, but it's not cool. So because I wear a fanny pack, socks, and sandals, all of a sudden I'm not lit, fam? Oh my goodness. It's not just that. It's your jokes, your puns. Okay, give me one example of a dad joke or pun that I did. When I answered the door, I said what's up, and you said this guy. So you're going to fault me for stating a very logical and scientific statement. You were not trying to make a scientific statement. Okay, fine. So I made one lame dad joke. You burped me yesterday. You literally patted my back until I burped. I thought it was helping you. You drive a minivan. It is reliable, lots of space, great gas mileage, safe. You go to bed at 8. I need my beauty sleep. All you do is talk about your kids. My kids are saints! Oh, by the way, Nightly just started doing 72-piece puzzles and he's only two years old, isn't that amazing? David, stop. Look, I think it's best if you leave, because our lives just don't add up anymore. Come on, guys, I'm still cool. I'm fam! Really, stop. Look, David, don't do this to yourself. Come on, guys, I learned this just for you guys. But you didn't have to. Come on, guys. <laughs> This my little, little Fortnite, right? Have some dignity, man. Okay, fine. And to think I was like a father to you guys. How do you not see the problem with that? Well, then I guess I'll just have to go get ice cream with my other friends. Ice cream? No, oh, he did this last time. He always pays. I'm paying. Thanks for the ice cream. Oh, no. Hey, you got a little... Hold on. Right there. I'm out of here, man. Joke's on him, because I'm taking you bowling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Woo! That is beautiful. Oh, yeah. Can't get any cleaner than that. Woo! That smells fresh. Did you just mow this lawn? Yeah. Yeah, I did. That's impeccable. Well, imagine what it would look like if I actually got paid to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know, I can never get my stripes to look so clean. How'd you do that? Oh, it's probably just the angle you're at. No, no, these are some state-of-the-art stripes. It's like a chessboard made of grass. I mean, I can't say that's not the look I'm going for. <laughs> hey, do you mind if I call my friend? He'd love to see this. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not doing anything right now. <laughs> Daddy, play cats? Hey, get inside! Get off the grass! Hey, Ron, man, you gotta come down the street to... What was your name again? Ricky. Ricky Sanchez. Ricky Sanchez is over here making his lawn look like Dodger Stadium. Oh, wow. Really? Oh, come on. I mean, I can see that. So you gotta come check it out. It's only about 10 houses down in our neighborhood. Oh, on my way. Hey, dude, how long did it take you to do this? About an hour. An hour? What, do you have a supercharger on your lawnmower? Don't tell me you have a Husky. Yeah. Yeah, I do. You dirty dog, you. That is some mighty fine equipment you got there. Guilty as charged. Or supercharged. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me right now. I told you, Ron. Do you run a landscaping company? Oh, no, I'm, I'm just a financial advisor. Don't lie to me, Sanchez. I, I'm serious. I'm not a landscaper. What equipment are you using? Oh, you know, just a uh, husky. Just sent shivers down my spine. Literal goosebumps on my arm right now. You got it all, Sanchez. You know, you could tell a lot about a man just by looking at his lawn. I've never been so jealous in my entire life. I literally want to be you. I hate how much I respect you right now. Oh, um... Thank you. My daddy ran a landscaping business for 30 years. And he never made it look like this. He's a fraud, I tell you. Well, I mean, I do what I can. Two and three quarter inches? That's impossible. What's your secret? There's no secret. Ah, just the man dedicated to his lawn. You got to quit your job right now and mow lawns. You got a real gift, Ricky. Don't tempt me, because I would. I'd love to shake your hand, Sanchez. Well, put it here, Ron. Hands is still, Ricky. Hey, Bill, could you take a picture of me and Ricky? We'd like to have his picture-perfect lawn in the background. On it.
Say husky. 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 Got it. I'm gonna text this to my dad right now. Wait till all the other guys find out about this. They're gonna be fuming with jealousy. Oh, I'm sure they can mow their lawns just fine. Stop it, Sanchez. You're like Houdini with this lawnmower. Enough of this humble act. Own it. I mean, I hope this doesn't sound strange, but can you maybe mow my lawn? Wow. I never thought I'd see the day. Oh, man, that is quite the honor. Wait. Can you mow my lawn, too? And mine? And mine? Ricky, 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 Ricky. Don't stare at the sun for 15 minutes straight. It really hurts. It's horrible. David! My life just flashed before my eyes. Your life flashed before all of us. What do you mean? We saw everything. Everything? You still wet the bed? What? You cry yourself to sleep every night? You saw that? I saw everything too. And you should really get that checked out by a doctor. <gasps> what else did you see? Dude, you stole my bike. And you traded it for Pokemon cards. I got a Pikachu. I know, I saw it. Okay, I'm sorry, man. What else did you see? I wish that car would've just hit you. You take that back. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with me? You almost just ran me over. You're filthy human. This is getting ridiculous. You guys obviously saw everything, huh? whoop de doo So let's just get it over with. Ha 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 You guys are laughing. whoop de doo you saw it. Take a picture. Take a picture. You're staring so long. Unless there's something else someone else needs to say, I suggest we just move along. I got something to say. Officer, you're just in time. This gentleman right here, he tried to run me over with his car. Oh, I saw it. I saw everything. Everything? Ah! Uh, officer, what did I do? Oh, you know what you did. It ain't great. <gasps> ah! No, officer, please, no. You know, the streets aren't for everyone. There's so many gangs out there, they don't just let anyone join. Believe me, I tried. That's why I'm starting my own gang. Online. The first internet gang. Now you shut up, man! It's the Cryptos, yo! Cryptos for life! When Carlos asked me to join his gang, I was like, I gotta ask my mom, fool. But then when he told me it was an internet gang, I was like, I gotta ask my mom for the Wi-Fi password. Check it out. I'm about to cop all this merch with a stolen credit card. That's your mom's credit card. I know. Dang fool, you a real G. Give me one of those It's Every Day Bro sweaters. Update card. I mean, we pretty much rule the cyber streets. We go on people's YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Musical.ly, whatever, and we talk mad trash. We don't even care. But it doesn't stop there. We also go and steal people's content and we repost it without giving credit. Oh, that's a nice meme you got there. That's my meme. Oh, that's a nice viral video you got there. That's my viral video. Mm, and leave a hate comment. You see those right there? I don't even know what I'm looking at. What I like to do is leave bad reviews for businesses on Yelp for no reason. I like to think of it as internet graffiti. <laughs> Yeah, no, you get it. You get it. Yeah. We don't even use cash anymore. We strictly Bitcoin. That's why we call ourselves the Cryptos. Thank you for coming in. So you want to be a crypto? Uh, yeah, why not? You think you could be an internet thug? You know, we digital gangsters. Yeah, we're like cyber mean girls. Man, we're nothing like cyber mean girls. But we're nothing like cyber mean girls. Well, I've actually hacked into about three different websites in less than a day, so. Well, um, so you got a little experience online. Yeah, but how strong are you with Excel? Hey, honey, would you and your friends like some cookies? Mom! I told you we're interviewing new gang members! Sheesh! Oh, that's right. Sorry, pumpkin. Now you know you gotta be initiated, right? Yeah, I know. What's your Instagram handle? At the homie 28. The 
call me 28. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. This initiation begins now, and if you quit, you can't be in the gang. I'm actually joining the cryptos because I can smell his mom's cookies from next door and they're just, oh, they're so delicious. And plus I'm an online hacker anyway, so it kind of makes sense. Oh, uh, they're leaving hate comments on all of my Instagram posts. It's uh, part of the gang initiation or something like that. <laughs> you know we gonna feel this in the morning. I feel it right now. <laughs> oh, I gotta go. Your mom goes to college. <laughs> what? Yeah, we straight thugs. Uh, thug Internet thugs. Welcome to the cryptos, yo. Yeah, first order of business, I'm gonna add you as an admin on our Facebook page. Oh man. What? My mom shut down the Wi-Fi again. Is this because we won't let her in our gang? Probably, can't we just let her in? We can give her a fake profile, fake name. She lets us live here for free. Nah, man, that's never gonna happen. I mean, everything is online or on demand now. Food, groceries, rides, jobs. The way the world is going, you won't ever have to leave your couch. That's why I decided to bring the streets inside the house where it's a little bit safer, you know? Man, these are good. Thanks, homie. Uncle Juan, I really want to learn karate, but no one will teach me. Do you know karate? Eduardo son. Of course. But you know what? Karate takes a lot of work. And it, you're gonna do a lot of training and it's gonna seem super unnecessary. It's almost gonna seem like you have a job and you're like working for me. But just remember, you're learning karate and it's necessary. Okay, what you gotta do is you gotta wash this car and you gotta wax on and you gotta wax off. How is this gonna teach you karate? Don't worry about it, just, just get to work. Car wash, $10. Car wash. What? Come on, we got customers, I mean trainers. Hurry up. Car wash. I don't understand how this helps me with karate. Eduardo son. It's like for cardio and stuff. Come on, let's go. Paletas, paletas, 1.45, paletas, paletas. How is this supposed to be helping? It's, uh, it's for your core. Come on, man, you should know these. Okay, there's no way this is helping me with karate. You know what, you got me. I just really wanted you to wash my dishes. Uncle Juan, there's a tournament this weekend. Uh, you're gonna be ready, but you gotta do a couple of more chores. I mean, training. Stop with your games. I need a karate gi. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Come on. Okay, Eduardo, son. Remember everything that I taught you. But you didn't teach me anything. Okay, you know what? Stop with the technicalities. Go out there and win. Okay. I want a good, clean fight. This doesn't seem like a legit organization. It is. Okay, ready, set, go! Two points! Yes! Ah, dang it! Ah, no much. Come on! Get back into it! One more point, and we have a winner! Okay, ready, go! Oh, yes! Woo! I did not see that gun! Good job, man! But be careful with your hands, because you still gotta watch a couple of guards. Okay, I don't know how this point system works, but next point wins. Okay, ready, set, go! And the winner is Eduardo! Yes! I'm proud of you, Eduardo. I really doubted you were gonna pull that off. Really? Anyways, there is so much more for you to learn. Like, so many more, like, exercises, and you're gonna be like a black belt in no time. Am I done with my training now? No. Oh, don't you wanna be a karate black belt? Yes. Okay, then. Oh, and when you're done with the floors, uh, finish the bathroom. I could do this all day. Well, unfortunately, I don't have the time. Ah, what was that? We're going to iron all this out right now. Don't worry, I got this. What? Who are you? I am Iron Juan. Is he with you? Uh, no. Oh, 
Okay, hold on, Capitan. My paperwork is still in process, but I applied to be an Avenger a couple of months ago. You can't just apply to be an Avenger. Well, yeah, and how did you become an Avenger? I was injected with a super soldier serum. I fought Red Skull. I was frozen in a block of ice for 70 years, and I woke up to stop an alien invasion. Okay, but did you fill out the paperwork, though? What? I mean, come on. There's one to get their flu shot, fight Clifford the Big Red Dog, watch Frozen for 70 years, and stop Alien vs. Predator from ever being made to be an Avenger? I mean, what kind of criteria is that? You didn't hear a thing I said, did you? I don't think he did. Exactly, thank you. Oh, look at you teaming up with the enemy. Just wait till HR hears about this. HR will not hear anything about this because you're not an Avenger. Not yet, but just wait until my paperwork goes through. Okay, you know what? Stop mentioning the paperwork because there is no paperwork. Let me prove myself then. I'll take care of this guy. I'd love to see you try. Well, do you have an iron deficiency? No, why? Because your shirt is wrinkled. This can't be happening right now. Look, I can't let you fight him. What are you protecting the bad guy now? What kind of Avenger are you? I'm not protecting the bad guy. I'm protecting you from him. Why? I'll flatten him out real good. Because he's a dangerous criminal with highly sophisticated weapons. Okay, maybe they should start calling you Captain Obvious. <laughs> okay, enough is enough. Thank you for that. Did anyone order a one-shot Americano? <laughs> I guess you're gonna have to prove yourself now. Oh, sweet! Here's my chance! I'm gonna burn you so bad. The way I can mad! I can do this all day. This won't end well for you. Come out, come out, wherever you are. What happened? He got bored. And I straightened things out. Hello? Captain, is the suspect in custody? Yes, but I didn't capture him. What? Who did it then? He goes by the name of Iron Juan? Iron Juan? Iron Juan? Oh yes, I'm actually reviewing his application right now. What? Paperwork finally went through. You know how that goes. So how do you do? Uh... He got the job done. Great, he's gonna be an exceptional addition to the team. Yeah, I... I think so too. Look, I'm sorry. That's okay, I forgive you. Really? Yeah, I like things to go smooth. I could tell. Grudges are just the wrinkles of a bitter heart. Well, thank you. Looks like duty calls. Wait. Do you want to take this one? My name is Senor Iron Juan. Thank you all for coming by for this lovely Thanksgiving meal. Let's just get to the point. Who's gonna carve the turkey? You wanna serve the jerky? No, carve the turkey. Starve the corgi? Estás loco, what are you talking about? I don't know, fool, but I'm hungry. I think we should go around the room and have everyone say what they're thankful for first. Okay, but first, pick a card. Okay, here we go. What about the way about that brujeria life? Well, I'll do it. Ricky, don't encourage him. Nothing wrong with a little old magic trick. You know, I have a dog that does magic. He's a labracadabrador. <laughs> This fool. I know a little bit of magic myself. I think we have enough magicians at this table already. Check your shirt pocket. What? You haven't even set up a trick or anything. I've been setting up this trick for years. All right. April Fool's. You can't do an April Fool's prank in November one. But is it November? Really? Mowing season's back, baby. I better start stretching. You don't need to stretch. Ricky, 
Ricky, Ricky, skip around the room. Skip around the room. Guys, we're supposed to say thanks and then eat. I'm thankful I don't have your attitude. Wow. And I'm thankful for my Husqvarna. What a horror? No, my Husqvarna. Your mother's drama? Husqvarna. This is Sparta? It's a ride in lawnmower in which I throw down some serious stripes. Then just say that, Vato. And I'm thankful that I'm a good listener. And I'm thankful for this. This guy knows his stuff. Great. And I'm thankful for this meal. How about we just carve the turkey now? But where is the turkey? Don't tell me you did something to the turkey. Yep, I knew it. Check Juan's mouth. What? Is that your turkey? How is that a magic trick? Because I'm going to make this turkey disappear. Hold on, it's gonna take a minute. You're gonna be amazed. Super good trick. Someone needs to clean this. Hey fool, how about you spread the magic over here and give a vato a wing or something? Check your pocket. No. Madre de la chupacabra. Hey Houdini, how about you hand some over here? <laughs> 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 I knew you were winging it. <laughs> hey, we're supposed to say thanks and then carve the turkey, not put on a show. Is it about what we do or who we do it with? <sighs> You're right. I'm sorry, Juan. I forgive you, Mendigo. Thank you for that. I'm thankful for all of you. And for all of you. Me too, but way more. Okay. Hey, is there a fire? No, there's no fire. Then why are you guys here? Because we received a call. For a fire? No, not for a fire. I thought you guys were firemen. We are. Why are you here if there's no fire? Sir, 80% of fire calls are medical, um, and that's why we're here. Hey, is there a fire here? No, apparently these guys don't put out fires. But they're firemen. <clears throat> I think they're just EMTs pretending to be firemen. Fire department, anybody home? Let me knock the door down. I know I can do it. Relax, Proby. I just knocked once. <laughs> Anybody home? Fire department. Oh, the door is open. Please come in. Sir, are you okay? Did you call 911? Uh, yeah, that was me. What were you doing when you hurt your back? Oh, you see, what happened was uh, that box you see out there is a big box. It looks like it should be carried by maybe two, two and a half guys. My back just gave out the moment I looked at it. Ah! How would you describe the pain in your back? Is it sharp or dull? Um, it's one of those sharp, dull pains, you know? It's like my whole back is numb, but I feel everything. The uh, ambulance is five minutes out. Do you want me to call it off, or do you want to ride to the hospital? No, 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 that, that's fine. You know what? Uh, if, since you guys are here, um, can, can you help me just bring that box all around, you know, around the corner, put it in my garage, and set up my, my whole system there? Is there anything else we can do for you? No, that's all I want. Just take the box to the garage. Look at me. Do I look like I'm in a condition to pick up a box and set up a system? Ah! Yeah, sure we could do that for you. Uh, oh, great, thank you. Hey, can you do me a favor and grab me a water from the fridge there, buddy? I thought you wanted us to move the box for you. Yeah, but it doesn't take three of you, does it? Why don't you let the big boys do it and you go ahead and grab me a water from the fridge and a cheese stick? I'm a taxpayer, aren't I? Why don't you get that smirk off your face and put those tax dollars to work? Be right out, guys. Right that, Chief. Get the water bottle for me, I'm thirsty! Could have done that by myself. All right, Proby. Hey guys, I'm good to go. Oh wow, that looks great there, but it's not gonna do Ricky, me any good. You're back. Oh yeah, I never left. No, you're back. Oh, you know what? Must have been one of those things. I was just a little bit hungry. Hey, how come you don't have a mustache like those guys right there? Why do I need a mustache? I don't know. It's more professional. Oh, you know what? You're probably one of them little EMT in training, right? What? No, I'm the chief. I got a uh, wash and dry for Ricky at the front. I just need a signature. Get off me! Not you! That guy right there with the mustache! I got it. I got it. Get off me! 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 Get
Oh, I'll take care of that. You know, I was thinking about becoming an EMT too. What? Get out of here. Let's go. Can you guys bring in my washer and dryer? <laughs>